My name is Cassandra Owens. I am from Jackson, Tennessee, and I received my baccalaureate degree from Clark College, Atlanta, Georgia. The way I chose Clark is kind of funny. Uh, my parents are both lay nights, and so I took a lane basketball schedule that went down the schedule. Because I always knew that I would attend the HBCU, I just didn't know which one. And I just kept with the land on Clark, and that's where I thought this one had to go. I was vice president of my freshman class, and then I was um, vice president. Back then, we had a, a working panel in the council. I was president of the Panhale. Um, I'm a member of Sydney Gabriel Sorority, uh, where I've served um, as national chaplain in 2002-2004. I've served as advisor to numerous chapters in several different regions. In fact, I am going to Tacoma, Washington in November because I was a charter member of a chapter that they're going to honor me there. And I've also served at a regional level. So Sydney Gabriel has been a very big part of my life. You know, home is like a safe place. I want to come home and regroup. I didn't mean to stay 12 years, but 12 years later, I'm still here. Well, I love what I do. Uh, education is my kind of my thing. Um, I'm a good teacher, and I love my students, and I love coming to work. And so when you have a passion for what you do, it's easy to get to do it every morning. I teach world religions. I teach Old Testament, and I teach black church history. Those are my favorites. Now, my real favorite is probably Old Testament. I just like the God of the Old Testament. He was very, I call him kind of gangsterish. Um, he said what he meant and what he said. And if you didn't do what he said, he just probably killed you. It's kind of cool for a God, I think. My thing is when students come to college, they should be introduced to new things. And one of the things I say in my class is don't take me to church because I want you to see the Bible and the Old Testament from an academic standpoint. And so in the class, it's really about what it means academically. You've lived all your life in church, and so I try to want you to have an academic side so you can merge the two and kind of challenge your faith to see where it really is. Because a faith that has been challenged to me is no faith at all. Again, with HBCU, um, my posse that I met there, we're still very close. We do girls trips, there's four of us. Um, me and my roommate and then two others. We st we're still extremely close. Their children call me auntie. So we do girls trips, we do homecoming every year. So I love to travel with, with those females and um, I love to read. I think reading is fundamental. I had a conversation the other day about writing and how people write well. But we kind of concluded that people that read well, write well. So I read and um, hang with those girls, those are my girls. And I'm always trying to find ways to improve myself. I think that we're always evolving. So I try to find ways to improve Cassandra and make her better, make her a better professor.